Elon Musk loves doing stuff that makes you say words like why, how and sometimes wow. In the why category of Elon's adventures is the Tesla Roadster that he sent to space back in 2018. Where is it now in space? Is it on Mars? Is it with the aliens? Or has an asteroid already destroyed it? Before we get to that, let's understand why it was sent to space in the first place. In February 2018, SpaceX was about to test the launch of its Falcon Heavy rocket. The goal of this mission was simply to test the capabilities of the rocket and gather information for future missions. Most rockets sent to space have some kind of payload that they drop when they're up there. Usually, it's satellites. However, putting satellites worth millions of dollars into a test flight does not make much sense. SpaceX needed something to put into the rocket. And that is when Elon Musk came with the bright idea and made a great marketing move by using his own midnight cherry Tesla Roadster as a dummy payload for the Falcon Heavy test flight. And suddenly, the poor Tesla was sent on a long, long ride. But don't worry, it wasn't alone. The car has a driver in it named Starman. It's a full-scale human mannequin fixed onto the driving seat. And looking at the success of the mission, he seems like a good driver. Four years after sending it into space, the Tesla Roadster is still there, constantly orbiting our sun at a very high speed of 8,900 miles per hour. It's surely much faster than the speed it would have had on Earth roads. The Tesla has driven past planets like Mars, Venus and even Mercury. If you want to know the estimated location of the car at any given time, you can head to fan-made tools like whereisroadster.com. The website uses various algorithms and a lot of programming to predict the location of the Tesla Roadster. At the time of this recording, it seems like the car is pretty close to Venus. If you're someone who expects it to come back to Mother Earth one fine day, then I have some bad news for you. It's highly unlikely that the car will ever be able to step foot, I mean tires, on Earth. But according to a study, the car will have its first close encounter with Earth in 2091. So stay tuned for that. In the next 1 million years, there's a 6% probability that the Tesla Roadster will collide with Earth. So stay tuned for that as well. If that doesn't happen, it will stay in space for millions of years to come. Long after you and I are gone. This was it for today's video. Thank you for watching.